school bus drivers from Crease Transportation have doubled the size of this year's Stuff the Bus donation drive. All donations will go to kids in need right here in the Mid-State this holiday season. Kayla Schmidt joins us live this morning in Spring Grove, York County with more. Good morning, Kayla. Good morning to you, James and Allie. Well, as Brett said, the weather is looking good to get out and do some activities. It's also looking good to get out and donate. I have Tammy Swartz with me from Christ Transportation uh, talking about their Stuff the Bus donation drive this morning. Tammy, good morning. Good morning. Hey, you hanging in good? Absolutely. Wonderful. So now we are upstairs. Can you tell me about the whole operation up here? How did this whole thing start? So the operation upstairs is a combination of brand new toys, shoes, um, coats. Coats is how it all started. Um, basically, um, we had kids coming to the bus stop and didn't have winter coats. Um, and we were in a different school district at that point in time. And there was a lot of poverty issues there. So they couldn't necessarily afford a coat. Um, so the drivers started going together and saying, what can we do to help? And so they just started bringing coats in. They'd say, hey, does anybody have any coats this size that maybe your children outgrew? And they brought them in. And that was eight years ago. And it has just grown from coats and hats and gloves to toys, households, furniture, um, food. And so now we also have brand new toys and things like that. So if a family comes in and they're in need of something, they don't have nothing for under the tree for their kids, grandkids, what have you, mm -hmm. we get age appropriate gifts, give them with a roll wrapping paper or we wrap it and- They're on their way. Yep. And they come in and pick whatever they want. There's no questions asked. We don't ask your name. We don't ask income, none of that. They can just, just walk in, shop, Yep. and leave. Absolutely. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Tammy. What a beautiful story and really goes to show how much bus drivers make an impact in the local communities. Yes, Ali and James, I will send things back to you in the studio. Tammy, thank you so much. Sure. We'll hear again from Tammy in our next half hour, but for now, live in Spring Grove, Kayla Schmidt, ABC 27 News.